Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Amy. Today's video is a clean with me. Um, I'm going to get a little bit of picking up done in my kitchen real fast. And then most of it is going to be me and my husband going out to his man cave and tackling the extreme mess that's in there. Um, between being gone for eight months and coming home and being back and forth with other jobs and such, he has not hardly even been out there. He hasn't even hunted much this year. Um, he just, he has not had time to go out there and clean. Um, so we wanted to take, get that done and tackle it today. So you'll see us here shortly going out there and getting that done. And it looks so much better now that it's clean. But as you can see here, I'm just cleaning my counters off a little bit. I'm going to wash up the couple dishes that's left and get started in the man cave. So you're not actually going to see me wash dishes for some reason my camera cut out and I didn't realize it so as you can see they were washed um, now I'm cleaning my sink um, every time I wash dishes I like to just spray a little bit of power wash and give it a good scrubbing um, usually I do this about twice a day um, and then every once in a while I'll go in and do a deep clean of the sink but usually twice a day or so I will I like to scrub it out. I just like the way the power wash gives it a good shine. I keep a photograph in which we want love caught in your eyes waiting for the sunrise. I barely even knew who you were. What did you do? I didn't care cause you were perfect I swear. Somebody told me that it's over, I know it's true You made me happy for a while I remember fleeting times when we slept on top of cars Now I don't know you, you don't know me too I remember fleeting times when we watched this park so far Now the kitchen's all clean, everything's wiped down, all the dishes are washed, and it's good to go for a while. Now it's out to the man cave. This dog will literally let my kids do anything to her. They're always putting dresses on her and all kind of stuff. Um, she was not happy about this headband, but she, again, just lets them do it. Um... I was actually eating a bite of lunch real quick, so she was trying to beg for a bite. But anyways, that's the kind of life she she lives around here. Now, this is my husband's man cave. Again, I told y'all it was an extreme mess. Um, stuff has just been piled in here over the past year of us being gone. Um, so we wanted to take this nice, beautiful day, um, take advantage of it, and get this, this room cleaned up and back organized and smelling good and ready for whatever adventures it it holds
So to start out here, we're just going to be literally pulling everything out and putting it under the carport so that he can kind of see what he's got, see where everything needs to go. Some stuff needed to go to his shop, some stuff needed to go in the attic, um, in the boat, different things like that. So he's just going to pull it all out and then we'll get the room kind of cleaned up a little bit and then he'll start putting what needs to go back in the room in there. This awesome little gadget is a handheld chainsaw. Uh, my stepdad had one here a few months ago and we were at their house and he was showing it to my husband and me and him both were like, oh, that is so cool. He needs one. So I ordered my husband one and he loved it. So we ended up getting his dad and stepdad one for Christmas as well and they both really loved it. Um, so it's on Amazon. Uh, it was about 50 or $60 dollars. Um, I will try to remember to link it in the description box below, but if your husband uh, or yourself even uh, ever needs a little handheld chainsaw, this is definitely what you need because it's awesome and it works amazing.
coming in with a clothes hamper. Um, he had a huge pile of camouflage clothes on the floor. Um, since they've been sitting there for a year, I figured we would just go ahead and take them in and get them all washed and cleaned and ready for next year. I've already swept the floor and now I'm going over it with the vacuum. I will not be mopping in here. Um, it probably needs it, but we really don't mop out here much um, only because it's it's just his hunting room, his man cave. Um, it gets it stays filthy anyways. Um, so I did not mop. Um, but here I am cleaning the ceiling fan. Uh, it probably hasn't even been cleaned since we moved in seven years ago. Um, so it desperately needed it. Um, but just a little cleaning tip, um, a lot of you may know about it, but I take a pillowcase and I slide it over the fan blades and just kind of squeeze the fan blade as I work my hands down to the end and all the dust falls off into the pillowcase, um, so that the dust doesn't fly everywhere. You still, of course, get a little bit of dust, you know, falling here and there, but it's not near as bad as all these clumps of dust going all over the place. So just a little cleaning hat for you. We actually do have more blinds up in our attic. Um, we just got to get them down and measure them and make sure they're going to fit. But these two windows right here really need blind replacement soon. was trying to see if my son could pull my bow back because me and him are both left-handed and he doesn't have a bow um, and I don't ever hunt with it so he was seeing if he could pull it back or not and he couldn't um, but you just saw my daughter I promise you y'all she had shorts on underneath that shirt that is a t-shirt that she won at a giveaway somewhere I don't even remember anymore um, but it's it's an extra large adult size and she uses it to sleep in all the time and so yeah she was still in her sleep clothes um it was kind of a lazy day for her i guess you could say um but she i promise you she did have shorts on underneath that it was not just a, a nightgown walking around um she had clothes on <music>
this is our cousin's little boy. Um, him and my son were going around with a BB gun. Um, that bo that shell box there does not have shells in it. I promise you, it just has BBs. Um, but he likes to feel grown, so he had his BBs and his BB gun, and they were going to see what they could find out in the yard. done this is the final look of the room everything's clean we will have a mattress on that bed um, but thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed and if you did be sure to give it a thumbs up and click subscribe and be sure to click that little bell so you don't miss any of our next videos we'll see you in the next one bye, bye.